Welcome to the World Register. The World Register is an independent news source providing truthful, unbiased, and timely reporting about people, places, and events. Reuters News Agency reports that more than 400 people were killed in Iran when a magnitude 7.3 earthquake jolted the country. Rescuers were searching for dozens trapped under rubble in the mountainous area. At least six have died in Iraq as well. State television said more than 407 people were killed in Iran's deadliest earthquake in more than a decade, and at least 6,600 were injured. Local officials said the death toll would rise as search and rescue teams reached remote areas of Iran. South Front reports that U.S. and Israeli officers broke ground in Israel on September 13th for a permanent U.S. Army base that will house dozens of U.S. soldiers. According to Israeli officials, the U.S. base will be an independent facility co-located at the Israeli Defense Forces Air Defense School in southern Israel. Once completed, the base will house U.S. operational systems to identify and intercept a spectrum of aerial threats, along with barracks, recreational, and other facilities. And the Washington Times reports that two House Republicans delivered an ultimatum Monday to Attorney General Jeff Sessions, telling him either to name a special counsel to investigate FBI Director James Comey's handling of last year's election, or else resign to clear the way for someone who will. Representatives Jim Jordan of Ohio and Matt Getz of Florida said questions are piling up over the way Mr. Comey conducted the investigation of former Secretary of State Hillary Clinton's secret emails and the FBI's treatment of an anti-Trump dossier.